guys, today I'm going to be doing my fitness spread for the first week in June in the Erin Condren and I am going to be using the Scribble Prince Co. Don't remember what this kit is called but it was one of her. She did three releases. There was this one, the strawberry one, and the, the bird one. So I'm going to be using this and some of you may be saying but this is like a full kit and why are you doing this in your fitness planner and isn't this going to be a waste of stickers and blah blah blah. So I'm not going to be using this but I figured this kit is so close to June colors that I could really easily use this with another kit like I have a planner Kate kit I think this would look really nice with. So I can use everything on this page pretty much and everything on this page I can use the half boxes for uploads, this and this and then not these but like again I could use this with the planner Kate kit that I got just the full boxes you know so I can I can make this work with other things in June so those are the only two sheets that I'm not going to be using and obviously I won't be using like the icons and I might not use this side of things but you know I am fine using what I'm going to use because I really wanted to use this kit in a planner that I was going to see for a week there's some kids I don't mind doing a mock spread just to do the spread and be able to do a video on it um, but this one I really liked so I wanted to make room for it and because I have these checklists I might do just half boxes on the bottom and then do the checklists under YouTube for um, like my to do's so I'm gonna go ahead and start and I have a band-aid on my thumb because my thumbnail like I hit it against something I think at work and it's it like broke really far down and it's just my fingers a hot mess so we'll go ahead and put this down I really am glad she's doing the thicker bottom washi not a fan of the thinner and I am I think going to put the half boxes like do I want to put them down here let me let me see what this looks like I'm gonna put down I'm gonna like go so out of order everyone who watches these is gonna be like what are you doing um I'm gonna put these down because I want to see what everything looks like I was this Band-Aid is making me a little clumsy, but aside from that, it's better than I thought it would be. But I want to see how these half boxes look down here. I'm really, really, like, looking forward to this week being a little more normal again. Um... We've just had so much going on on the weekends again. I mean, I'm filming this on Monday, if that tells you anything. I almost always film this on Sunday. Um, my One of my husband's really good friends who was in, like, our wedding, he was in town on Saturday. And then yesterday we drove to my aunt's house and had, like, a grill out with my mom's sisters. My parents weren't there because they don't live here, but... I was I saying what was I saying yeah I just haven't really been home and so I have worked out there was one day this week I didn't work out it was the first day all bikini series that I haven't worked out and I was okay with it I like got a ton of stuff done that day it was like I took the day off because I was running around doing so much stuff and it was just stuff I needed to get done and so I was like active that day it wasn't like I was sitting you know what I mean? Like other days where I've not wanted to work out, I would have just been like sitting doing nothing all day instead. Um, I'm going to put this up here, the thankful thoughts while I'm at it. I left my, it's probably not a smart decision, I left my hot pink fluff thingamabobber on tassel. That's the word. That was the word. And 
Sorry if like the little spots of light are annoying if I film before noon this happens because I have direct sunlight in the morning through all of my windows and my desk that I film on is in front of a window and my tripod is like on half on the windowsill and then like leaning against my desk like that's how I keep it from falling over with like the camera out on the Z bracket so far. Um, but like it parts the vertical blinds a little bit so I get this like column of light down the center of my desk. Okay, so I have that. I have that. And then I have these and I think I'm going to do the pink because I think I have a lot of... Mm, yeah, I think, I think the pink works best with this. The, the blues in the planner Kate are like more blue blue and less teal. Okay, I have to turn this. I can't leave this open. I've tried some people like, are like, why don't you leave your planner open the whole time? Well, I don't know how you plan, but I find it almost impossible to like not have things centered in front of me and I don't know, it's just like I can't do it. Can't do it. <laughs> there is that. And then do I wanna do the checklist? Where did the checklist go? Where did that sheet go? I put it over here. Do I wanna okay, let me Oh, she split this up into like pieces instead of just having it be like the big chunk. I could put this here with a header. Let me... I'm gonna put in next week and then I can like write down spreads I think I'm gonna do or something. That header's a little a little off. And then that fits almost exactly. There's like a really thin line of the blue down there, but I'm just going to leave it. Um, my camera is telling me that it's about to die, which is a little uh, weird because I just took this battery out of my wall charger. Um, I have another one in there right now, so it'll, if it dies, I'll be able to like go back to film pretty quickly. I'm going to put my meals headers down while I'm at it and then we'll see what my camera is doing. It is actually pretty hard to put this stuff down with a band-aid on my finger. I feel like a giant klutz. This pink is pretty close so that's nice. I love June's colors. I love June and July and I didn't get to do June last year because I got like my planner in July in the year in Condren and so it was when I switched over and I really have been looking forward to doing July for a whole year because that was when I started watching plan with me videos it was like June July so I saw a lot of these colors then and that was what made me like fall in love with with decorating with stickers and stuff so Okay, so then I'm going to go ahead and do my, like, normal thing that I do every week. Every week. Wow, I didn't say week right. Wow. Um, do my uh, fitness headers and then full boxes and then YouTube and then checklists. 
So I might actually put checklists down and then put like a, the half box on top of it, but I want to use these instead of using, I pulled these out like to maybe use this color, but I feel like I want to use what's here and maybe I'll go across and cut all of them, but I feel like I'd rather just put them down. I don't like to live on the edge. I can't, I hate cutting stickers. It makes me so anxious when I have to cut stickers. So I think I'm gonna just do that. I know I talked about like putting the half boxes down here, but I don't wanna cover up this bottom washi. Honestly, I rarely need six YouTube things. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then I will be back. zoomed in the way I have been for the past few weeks while I put down my workouts and I do have my planner Kate workout labels sitting right here and I'll probably use like alternate between like the blue and the pink or something or the two maybe I'll alternate between these two because I feel like these blues just don't work as well maybe I'll, I'll go between those two but I have my schedule pulled up and let me I think I'm actually just gonna like I have the PDF pulled up if it wants to like let me zoom in I think that'll be okay I think I can see it enough maybe yeah okay instead of going through each day and reading it because I kind of wanted to talk. I didn't really get to talk about like this week or how I'm doing in the bikini series which is something I normally do in these videos. So, so far everything's going really well. Like I said earlier, I've only missed one day of working out this whole series. Though this week I missed a couple of the workouts but I worked out every day if that makes sense. I just had a really busy week but I did make time to work out. And there were some days like yesterday on the schedule, it was like running and abs. And I had no, like absolutely no desire to do cardio abs, which I've done I think 8,000 times since uh, this whole thing started. It's been on the schedule like twice a week and I'm, I was did not want to do it. I was not looking forward to it and I did not want to go run, so instead I did Ultimate Booty Call from uh, Beach Babe DVD 3, and that worked out really well. There's a new workout coming out on Tuesday. I do like to do, like at least try them when they come out. So we'll do that, and then I also have that and Oh, there's another cardio thing on here. I 
I'm gonna write these out as I'm going. I don't know why I wasn't doing that. <laughs> I'm actually gonna have to tilt this a little bit to write. But, I mean, I feel good. I can tell a difference, like, in how I look. My clothes are fitting a little bit more loosely. Um, it was not a great week for food. It wasn't horrible. I'm just gonna scrunch that in. I'm like writing really poorly today. Am I still in frame when I tilt like that? Yeah. Just because... Let's do... Two miles... K and K. New workout, and then legs for days. Um, what was I saying? That the, um, there were a lot of Oreos in my life this week. That was definitely a thing. <laughs> um, but I'm, I don't know, I feel a lot better about where I'm at than I did at the beginning. Like, I'm definitely seeing a lot more progress as it goes on. Um, this, this has rock your body and cardio abs, but cardio abs is in the like not beach babe section because they released it as a YouTube video. Um, so, you know, I feel good about it. It's just, I think I've had to like realize that these aren't changes that are going to happen overnight and that I committed to this like long term and that it's going to take more than eight weeks to reach my goals and that's okay. I mean, that doesn't make me a failure because I can't like fix all of my health and fitness issues in a week. I'm going to kind of angle it like this. Maybe I'll just put the stickers down and then write because it's hard to talk while I'm writing. But the... What did I start? I had the right at the top on that. But it's, it's good. I feel good. Um, I might have to like... Luckily there haven't, hasn't been like too much arm stuff on here because I think I like did something to my shoulder my left shoulder hurts a lot like not hurts a lot like when I'm not doing anything but even just like lightweight yesterday I like had to stop because um it wasn't feeling awesome Friday let's do Okay, so I'll have K and K slay. And I, I feel more comfortable switching stuff out at the beginning. I was like following everything so closely, like so to a T, because I wanted to get back into that like more regimented mindset. But I feel like now I'm like, okay, I don't want to do this hit, but I want to do a video I haven't done in a little bit, so I'm going to do this instead. Or I don't want to, I don't know if that makes sense, but I'm finding it like easier to just switch stuff out. I'm not like, because I think at the beginning I would have switched stuff out to make it easier or to like be lazy, but now I'm just like kind of bored doing the same stuff all the time, so. <laughs> Okay, 30 minutes of cardio and kettle flow. And I, you know, I've been running a little bit and getting in a couple miles here and there. I need to find a new audio book because I finished um, The Night Circus, which is my second time listening to it. It's awesome as an audio book. I think it probably works better as an audio book than an actual book, which is a strange thing to say, but um, a run and then total body tone up. 
total body tone-ups on here twice this week. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and fill this out and then I will zoom you guys out and we will get back to finishing the spread. Okay, so I'm pretty much almost done. All I need to do are my water bottles and the deco from that main page, which is over there, and then I just threw some stuff on the ground, but you know. Oh, and my weekend banner. Let me flip this. And put my weekend banner down. Recenter, y'all. And then I'm going to put my water bottles down. I'll do the pink ones. I'm going to do the same thing I've been doing. Where I put my water bottles up here at the top. some of this deco up here. decorated spread. I hope you guys enjoyed. I love this kit. I love the June colors and I'm so excited about all the spreads I'm going to be doing this month. I'm very excited. I'm like so pumped to start week six. It's like really like getting towards the end now and I just feel really good about it. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will talk to you next time. Bye guys! <laughs>